Our touch technology is fundamentally different than capacitive touch, which you've seen in the past. Uh, we physically sense the pressure of people's touches rather than sensing uh, capacitive changes, which is what uh, you have in other devices like the iPhone. And that gives us a fundamentally richer kind of data set to uh, interpret a user's touches. Um, and it's really the ideal technology for next-gen OLED uh, displays that are flexible and foldable and curved. With 3D Touch, you have two different sensors. Uh, one senses position, one senses force, and uh, our sensor basically combines both and does it better uh, than 3D Touch. We have a few different mobile demos showing some of the UI possibilities that are enabled by our technology, uh, and also some of the, uh, basically, just ways in which our sensor is much more robust than existing CapTouch technology. Uh, so we have, uh, in terms of new types of interactions, we can support, uh, we're basically limitless in the types of interactions we can support. So we can pick up a stylus, a paintbrush, the user can be wearing gloves, and they don't have to be special gloves designed for your phone. They can be you know, heavy winter gloves, medical gloves. Um, so it kind of unlocks new ways to interact with your device. We expect the first phones that incorporate our technology to be available uh, later this year or early next year.